that feed though. Six man on screen. You already know with the kill streaks. And then where you'll get that you'll get to see that that clip like later on in the video because I get it during this game. I just wanted to show you how how crazy. I'll show you my maniacal laugh when I when it comes to it or something. I don't know. You probably won't hear it. But uh, yeah, what's up, guys? This is Hero here, or the Mark of a Hero, or Hero the Hunter, or the Mark of a Hero the Hunter. Um, yeah, or by Anino, as some of you may come to claim me as now. But um, yeah, I'm bringing you another shotgun gameplay. I'm sorry, it's Combine, cause like, okay, I'm gonna say this: like, Combine is like the new raid or the new like, it's the map to get gameplays on. Like this map just flows better than every other map on this fucking game. Like, this is probably the only good map, to me anyways. Every other map is like, it's decent, they're not like bad, unless like, I know a map is bad. Like, I can't, I don't know if I can say a map is bad yet, but, Combine's a good map. I, I know that for sure, I just, I do my best on this, on this map. In any game mode that I, like, that I play. Like, this is gonna be a fan favorite if it isn't already. And whenever I'm in the lobby, people vote for it. So I'm I'm getting my and since like you can keep voting for um one uh one map over and over again it's usually this map which is pretty crazy so yeah this is already pretty much a fan favorite uh on Black Ops 3 but yeah I'm bringing you a shotgun gameplay 107 kills with the Argus shotgun I finally did it guys got 100 plus with a shotty pretty fucking crazy man I just I love this fucking shotgun look at this oh 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 I'm fucking multi kill with a fucking Argus. That was 100% accuracy right there, super kill. You already know, I love this fucking shotgun. And this is the best shotgun. I tried using the Haymaker, and it's probably, I would probably say the Haymaker is like second best. If I um, do say so. I tried using that that uh, that uh, that other third, that third shotgun or whatever. Or I don't know if it's the third or second. But that, that gun fucking sucks. It shoots too slow or something. The, the Argus, you know, it's like, it's like a, a good medium, you know. And it just, it, that range helps so much. And I'm using the Scythe uh, special ability. I'm not using a combat focus like I usually do. I don't know, I just felt like using the Scythe. And, you know, it does me good work here. And, uh, you know, this first part of the gameplay is from theater mode. So if you see a little, like, lag spike like, right there. And now I'm in, like, the actual where I actually got the gameplay. And I'm actually recording from it. Had to get, like, the first two or uh, the first two minutes from from theater because uh, it not all of it recorded. So uh, yeah, I guess I can thank theater for that. I mean, there, there there is a good reason to have theater in the game, but it leads to lag, which is unfortunate. But yeah, this Argus, like as you can see, like you've already seen my 98 gameplay most likely. I have a lot of views on that gameplay if you haven't checked it out yet. But this this be basically beats it, you know. I just this first round I go fucking off. I go really hell. I just I just bring the pain to the enemies, and honestly, this could have been a 150 plus game. If I had kept this momentum that I had in the first round, it's just the second round. I don't know what happened. I just I was losing my. I wasn't thinking when I was playing. I guess I, I was listening to the logic to the logic album at this time, and I was like, I was seeing City of Stars, and then it got into Stainless, and then I was just like reciting lyrics, not really thinking. But then again, that's how I play most of the time. Sometimes I just fucking I just I just sing along, and I just just destroy people with, with shotguns or. Any other gun I'm using, just have fun with the game, you know. You know this this game, you know. It reminded me of Modern Warfare 3, where I fucking hated it as hell that first, and I still do kind of hate it. But then you just get used to the bullshit. Like Modern Warfare 3 had a lot of bullshit regarding death streaks, like just the features of the game, not not the game itself. I don't think, in my opinion, like the actual game how it ran was good. It's just some of the features in the game were pretty bullshit. <laughs> Fucking death streaks, man. But but I was a noob for like the first three months that Monster 3 was out, so I used Dead Man's Hand because I was just that much of a noob. But uh, yeah, I'm getting a little bit off topic, but uh, yeah. This Argus, just use it. Just like, if you're gonna use a shotgun in this game, use the Argus. Unless you're going for Diamond, obviously. Which uh, my friend uh, Cotty Soda Cap here was along with, uh, I think I'm playing with Sniping Taco. Him too. And um, they were just going for Gold Camels or Diamond Camels, and I'm just here. Wrecking people with my scythe and my raps and my hata and my my wraith and my argus and kill feeds and choking kills and yeah you know you know so this first round just like I get a super kill like just like that real quick 
And then in the second round, you'll see me get all these feeds. But then at the same time, I'm also choking because I'm first of all, I'm not look. I, I can't I can't locate their spawn. I guess they just they just kept flipping or something. So I wasn't able to like collect them in packs or anything. So oh, and then there my raps killed me. That's not that's nice, you know. My kill streaks always kill me, no matter what the fuck it is. One day I'll have a hater killing me. You never know. That shit's just gonna when it gets shot down, it's just gonna fly down and, and kill me. But as you can saw, as you saw there, hopefully I got 59 kills in the first round, and uh, yeah, I, I you could tell this could have been a way better gameplay than just 107 kills. I mean, I'm glad I got 107 kills, but it it could have honestly been a ton better. And you know, I'm 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 happy, but I'm not complacent with my scoreline. You know, I'm just gonna keep keep trying to give you guys the best gameplays I can. Oh, and here's the fleet, the feed. Oh, oh, that accuracy in the six-man feed. You already know. I just be, I just be turning up with this Argus, man. It's just, it's just, it's the shotgun. This shotgun is just a lot of ton of fun to use. And then uh, sometimes I use it in Nuke Town, or I just use it on the small maps, or use it strategically if you're gonna use it on a big map. But like, yeah, just um, uh, I've just been chilling, you know. I've been busy with like. Finals, finals are coming up, and I technically don't have any finals, but I have essays, so I got no exams, but I have fucking, I have 14 pages of essays to, like, to, uh, take care of, which, uh, kind of sucks. But, um, you know, I'll get through it, for the most part, and, oh, wow, I just got a picture from Cody Soda Caps showing me his golden knife. Very interesting. Oh no, he got the hero camo. Okay, I think. Looks nice, Jordan. If you're gonna see this video. Um, what was I talking about? I don't even know what the heck I was talking about. Uh, my mind just like went, went, went vacant or something. I was talking about being complacent. Oh, finals, yeah. So I just, I have four, t I have a, basically have two essays. One's a seven pager or maximum of seven pages. They didn't, they didn't say a minimum. But, you know, I'm going to be pretty close to the max or something. I might make my, my paper, like, five pages or something. I got to, like, analyze ads and compare one of the, the current Democratic presidents or one of the current president presidential candidates and compare them to, to a, a presidential candidate in the past. And uh, I basically had to compare ads and talk about visual cues and how ads... Uh, get their point across about what they lead and the strengths of a president and uh, the mud sling and other mud swinging at other presidents, which is it's not a bad essay, you know. I'm, I'm gonna have fun with that. I chosen Bernie Sanders and Ronald Reagan because um, I think they're they're very similar in a way that you know Bernie might just like I don't know. They both they both seem kind of like well Bernie seems kind of revolutionary in a way to me. And Romney was kind of like that, too. And Romney had the appeal of Democrats, which was pretty interesting, as well as the Republicans. So, you know, unifying the parties together is pretty rare. And I feel like Bernie can do that, too, to an extent. I don't think to the extent that Romney had it, but I could be wrong, you know. There's still another, there's still another like, whole year to, to see what happens. And, yeah, and then the other essay, I don't know how long it is, but... It's most likely going to be seven pages. I really hope it's not. So that I'll not have to write like 10 to, or at least 12 to 14 pages. Or I would just be able to write 10 to 12 pages. But yeah, it's going to be a pain in the ass for these next couple of weeks. And then I have winter break. And then I can grind some gameplays. I can attempt to do the Easter egg again. We fucking failed uh, last time because somebody, somebody told us to stay there. We got fucking body by zombies. Uh, we were like on the second to last step too, which is sad, very sad. But uh, yeah, there's that Easter egg, and then what else am I forgetting? Uh, oh yeah, winter break, and then I can finally do the campaign with some amigos. If, if you haven't done the campaign yet, then during winter break, um, we can, you know we can do the campaign together or something. Cause I still haven't done it, cause I you know I want to have fun with the campaign with friends, and I want to do realistic mode, cause yeah, you can revive each other. And the zero, you're you're gonna be one shot, you know. It, I think it's just like it emulates the experience of being at war for real, you know, where you know one shot, you know, you're gonna die most likely, or you need a medic to like help. Oh shit! I needed a verb. I'm sorry. 
But uh, yeah, campaign's gonna be fun, and uh, yeah, you know that, that's that's pretty much the rundown of my life right now. I don't know if I'll bring another commentary type video again, cause you know I, I've just been really busy. Oh, fuck. Uh, hopefully you didn't hear that voice crack, but uh, it's cause I'm sick too. So when you're sick, your voice goes fucking crazy. Your voice inflection goes crazy, and naturally it just fucking sucks. I've got like a head cold or something. I don't know what the heck I have, but it's not that bad, bad of a sickness, but it still sucks. But uh, yeah, that's what's in store for me. I don't know if I'm going to make another like commentary like this for a while. Um, I hope you guys like the, the supply job videos and the, and the com my classes and stuff. I meant to post this gameplay on Monday, but you know, I just I, I don't want to do a commentary like this when like, my roommates are around. Cause then it, I don't know, it just feels awkward in a way, you know. So I just I just do it when they're both out of the the apartment, and then you know I just rock it. Oh, 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 oh. quad feed metal. Oh yeah, and I don't know if you checked, but uh, I think on the video it said I had like 22 quad feeds, and now I have like 27 or 28. So yeah, quads are pretty fun to me in this game. I really want to see how many quads I get by the end of the year, or by the end of the you know the cod cycle or whatever. <clears throat> before the next COD rolls in, if there's going to be a next COD, because I don't know if you heard, because Activision's going to be focusing on making movies now. So we'll see what happens, you know. We'll, we'll definitely see what happens with Call of Duty. But, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay uh, as much as uh, you enjoyed the commentary, hopefully. And, uh, you know, like, subscribe, and comment for more, or ask me questions and stuff if you're curious about something. And, yeah, have a good day.